Well, good morning, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Grumman Pilots YouTube channel. And as you probably saw on the Grumman Gang May 3rd, we had a AA1C November 1-5 Lima Mike go down in Georgia. Here's the news story on it. It was a tail dragger, but let's go and see what the newscast had to say. And so we would like to ask you, please subscribe, hit the like button, and hit the notify to stay current with our content. So here's a picture of the Canada aircraft and it was doing touch and goes um, a few days before the event. So this is what it looked like before you'll see it in the newscast. Again, a tail dragger by uh, Gene Plazak. Hi, pilot was hurt and airlifted to the hospital. That means for the story of Salsa Mata. So that the homeowners jump into action and save the pilot. Jack and Anna McKenna were in their home Monday night when they heard a loud noise. When they went outside, they saw that this plane had crashed. People living in the Seneca neighborhood are used to the sound of planes. The neighbors say they didn't expect one of those planes to crash into their yard. I heard what sounded like a tree crashing. The single engine plane crashed just feet from Jack and Anna McKenna's house. Jack McKenna says he immediately checked to see if anybody was hurt. He found the pilot with cuts and swelling on his face. The way the plane crashed, it literally threw it hanging upside down. He was inverted. It was totally gone. And there's a wing crumpled underneath the plane. And it sort of cartwheeled, we think, and ended up upside down. According to the Senate Fire Department, the plane took off from the Oklahoma County Regional Airport. The cause of the crash is being investigated by the FAA and NTSB. There's a tree that I think saved his life because the tree took the energy of the crash and bending over so that uh, it didn't hit the ground at uh, full speed. The mechanics say they're thankful the crash was not worse than it was. You can't prepare for it. All that you can do is react. About 60 feet from my house, a plane comes down. You, you don't just, you know, walk away and, and uh, you go and do what you can. I mean, I think that's what you hope everyone will do is look out for their neighbors. The homeowners tell me the plane is expected to be removed from the yard on Wednesday. In Oklahoma County, it plays as a seven years. According to the FAA, the pilot's injuries are serious. The Seneca Fire Chief says there were no passengers on the plane. And as they closed, it's going to be investigated by the NTSB. Um, that's not the issue that I wanted to discuss. Um, I can tell you from my personal experience that if you're going to put an airplane down, put it down near where people are. Putting it down in the trees away from everybody, if you're injured, no one's going to know you're there. Don't ask me how I know. So we hope you found all this useful and informative. Thanks so much for watching and have a good day flying your Grumman. And finally, here's Hopscotch with uh, Sweet Pea observing. He's playing with a little pink feathered twig. Now, the twig is made out of some material like honeysuckle. It just drives them crazy, and they love playing with it. She's resting up. As soon as he finishes, she will have her go. So enjoy them having fun.